We have a rod of length L, and it's got a torque applied to it. It's applied using a force, which generates the torque T1. So L1 with a force 1 and T1. Now what we do is we change this rod so that now it is three times the length. So we have three times the length. We change the force on it so that it's one and a half times the force. And consequently this changes the torque to T2. We want to find torque 2 in terms of torque 1. So all we do is we say torque 1 equals force 1 times lever arm 1. And that fits. We don't have to change anything. Torque 2 is force 2 times lever arm 2. Now the second force is 1.5 F1. 1.5 F1. The second length is 3 times L1. So this is torque 2. Now what we want to do is we want torque 2 in terms of torque 1. So we know torque 1 is F1 times L1, and we have F1 times L1 here. So I say torque 2 equals, I go 1.5 times 3, that gives us 4.5. And then we have F1, L1. But torque 1 is equal to F1, L1. So I just replace that with torque 1. Torque 2 equals 